Uh, hey guys, today I will show you how to create this effect. Uh, I don't know, it looks like uh, some beauty commercial or something. Uh, this uh, snaky, flowery uh, textures in the background. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so I have two videos and first of all I need to change the size of this video because it has a strange uh, aspect ratio. So I need this size from here. So fit. And then come on top. Okay. And fill. Now I need a switch top and turn on this blend between inputs option. And next step you can see uh, here it has a much more uh, smoother transition and uh, a little bit dr dreamy look. So I need a uh, feedback. Uh, level and composite and, uh, in this composite uh, operation will be over and send this to feedback and change the level uh, opacity a little bit down something like this. Now it has this dreamy vibe and also a nice when I'm changing this index uh, it's much, much more smoother. Okay so next step is a uh, fit and to change the resolution to HD and a no. Okay. And now uh, I'm going to make the background. This shapes. Uh, so it's really pretty easy. Just uh, select this no and this place and the noise stop. This should be HD as well. And connect it. And uh, now you must increase the period of this noise to something like 12 and animate the noise. Something like this. Okay, now and just copy it a few times, something like a four. Okay, and now we need the composite. To operation over. And uh, in every of these uh, feedbacks here, uh, sorry, noise here, uh, need to change the seat and also in one of these uh, displays we can change this extent to repeat to get more uh, shapes okay Next step is uh, this border here uh, and uh, the distortion of it. So, composite, and we can copy one of these select here, connect it here, and change operation to over and this uh, order here. Okay. So we 
now we have something like this. And we need a displace and blur. And connect this image from here to blur and displace here. And smaller value like uh, like this. Supply with this blur value here. Okay, and the next step is composite and this self from here and over as well. So we have two borders, and one is uh, distorted, second is. Okay. And now uh, we need this background color here and here. So we need to transform, scale it a little bit. Something like this. Uh, analyze to get the one color of it. And now I, I have a, a average color from the stuff here. Feed, change the resolution to HD. And composite. Change operation to over and to the order of layers. And uh, we can add a RGB key here to get a black background color added to this. Uh, and now we can scale it a little bit to get more color from here okay and we can uh, add some noise up on the top of this layer so I'm gonna copy one of these noises paste it uh, at the composite uh, here from noise uh, level and operation to over. Uh, change the noise period to zero. And in this over, changes opacity value to something really small, like, like this. Okay. And now we need to automate is switching between videos, so it's really easy. It's just an LFO with a null. An LFO is a ramp. To link this ramp to switch. And make it slow, a little bit slower. And also we can change this offset value a little bit. Now, one of these videos is a little bit longer in the normal state. Okay. Okay, so uh, that's all. So thanks for watching and see you soon in the next video. Bye.